this is my snowblower. It's a 2015 model Aaron's 28 inch wide snowblower. And uh, I stuck this engine on it. It is a 18 horsepower Onan Opposed Twin. The reason why I put this on it, long story short, the original engine blew up. The original engine, which is stuck back in there, decided at one point to rod knock. And I wanted something to replace it. And out of all the engines that I have up here, none of them are going to be powerful enough, and they all have the wrong shaft size. As far as I'm aware, I don't think anyone has really put an Onan engine on a snowblower. I mean, I know they're on garden tractors that have snowblowers on them, but not on an actual snowblower itself. And uh, this thing was a challenge to get this thing on. So in order for this engine to run, it actually has to have a battery. So I decided to use one of these sealed batteries. I was positive that it would be able to start the engine. It needs it for, you know, cranking over the engine, but it also needs it for 12 volts for the ignition. That's how it is with these engines. As for the gas tank, I'm just using this little uh, gas tank that came off of a little three and a half horsepower Tecumseh. It's not ideal, it's way too small of a tank, but it's good enough for me. It's just kind of hanging there right now. It does have screws that are going through these brackets so that it won't fall off, but I'm probably going to change that in the future. And then that's ran up to the carburetor. I am missing the air cleaner lid for this. Um, I actually did order one finally. I actually found one, but it hasn't come in yet. One giant thorn with this engine is the fact that it has a one and an eighth inch shaft. Now the original engine had a one inch shaft, um, so I actually had to get all new pulleys and I actually had to get a shaft extension. I had to cut it and a keyed shaft to bring the pulley out. And this takes a double pulley on this particular Aaron snowblower. And I actually made the pulleys in the front here that go to the auger. I made them spin faster so that I can uh, utilize the extra power that this engine has so I can throw the snow much further than... By the way, I've yet to put some kind of cover over this. The original cover will not work because the crankshaft sits higher and it's actually in the wrong place. I'm going to have to probably fabricate one out of sheet metal and that's just to prevent the snow from getting in here and causing some slippage.